You know what's great about recording video? Nothing! Absolutely nothing! You lose! Uh, so... I... Uh, well, this is the day where shit's supposed to go down, I guess. Um... So I already recorded this video, except... It's, um... My voice was recorded wrong, even though everything was set up the way it was normally, and it still was after I stopped the video, but it was all... The audio was all way too loud, and I have no idea why. My mic was, like, slightly closer, but not nearly close enough to make that difference. I'm just- I just have audacity up here so I can see the waveform of my voice as I talk, because I didn't know what else to do to make sure it wasn't peaking. Anyway... Hello! What? Seems like you made it just in time. That's just a car backfiring. Really? Sounded like a gunshot to me. Have you ever heard gunshots? We're- we're in cyberpunk hell, lady. Of course he's heard gunshots. Have we all at some point? Yeah, well... Okay, that- that is gunshots. I'm sorry, Jill. That- that was not gun- that was not car exhaust. I don't know, it's too dry. What do you mean, dry? Yeah, but gunshots have more echo! What if it's a firecracker? Ah, boss. Firecrackers? Yep, a couple of years ago there was an incident with some dude killed a cop. He managed to slip away because his pixel was mixed up with the usual MEGA CHRISTMAS firecrackers. Good old Mega Christmas. Too hollow for firecrackers. Well, whatever. This is not a morning talk show. I'm not paying you to chit-chat about meaningless things. At least not amongst yourselves. Right. Shouldn't lose time over a car's exhaust. Hey! Heh. Uh... Random music go. I, this, is there a reason this is, doesn't have a random button? Like, I don't really care. I'll, the music's pretty good, but... Whatever. Time to mix drinks and change lives. So tired of reading that. Welcome to Valhalla. Who are you? Are you George? From, from, from Seinfeld? You... You... Look at, look at this, look at this... Uh, this scarf. He's got like three bundles of scarf here. This is way too much scarf. Y you can't have that much scarf. And this popped collar! Get get out of my bar! I hate everyone. I do, Parker! Um... Hello, I'm looking for some information. What kind of information? What can you tell me about a girl named Kermit Rose? Er, <laughs> Crimson Rose? <laughs> <laughs> I said Kermit. Sounds like a tacky online handle. Although, tacky online handle is a bit redundant. Do you know anything about her? Nope, sorry. I have $80 here that might refresh your memory. But $80! My, my drinks cost $300. That's like, that's like offering me two bucks. He's offering me two United States dollars. Now that you've entered it, I remember something. Really? Yeah, I'm totally sure that I have no idea whatsoever what you're talking about. Nothing at all? Nothing. Man, you're a real sucky bartender. Not having in for any. <sighs> well, first of all, why well, assume I just happen to have the info you so conveniently need? Does that girl frequent this place? Is there proof I might have the info you so desperately need? Now, speaking of desperately need, I kind of need, like, a boom arm for my mic. Unfortunately, the Blue Yeti is a very heavy mic. It's like 3.5 pounds on its own. But there was an arm I was looking to get. It's like a hundred bucks. But if it means less issues and like I can keep it a consistent position without, you know, I currently have to take it on and off my desk a lot because it's a very big mic and uh, the cord gets in the way and stuff. But I'm thinking of getting that boom arm. Um, just a shout out to my patron. Um, stuff like that is where, and you, you don't have to donate to my patron either. I There's a PayPal link on my site and there's a fan funding thing on my YouTube channel. Um, just donations go for stuff like that, like, my current next purchase will be a video card so I can encode faster and games will have less frame drop issues. Obviously not a problem for this 30 frame per second pixel art visual novel, but, uh, rendering actually is very slow, um, 
I changed my vendor, my rendering software, and it basically, if I put in a 30 minute video, it takes about 30 minutes to render or more. Even if it's like super low res pixel art stuff, I don't, I don't understand it. But uh, yeah, I also need a new bone arm. Basically, give give money and I can record less suck. That is that is the gist of what I meant. Well, I. And second, you're not going to get anywhere by offering me physical money. In fact, what are you even doing with physical money? Do you want to get mugged so badly? Yeah, well. Ma'am, ma'am, I am Kermit the Frog, and you, you, you cannot assault a superior officer like this. Moreover, oh, I'm busting out the moreovers. Moreover, even if I did so know something, do you really think eighty dollars is enough? If you don't watch out, buddy, I'm gonna break out the whilst and the thereafters. You can do almost nothing with eighty dollars. It's not even enough to buy a decent lunch. Why are you scolding me, ma'am? I am a very important person, you see. Why did you call me a sucky bartender for not conveniently knowing the info you needed? I... wait. Of course, you want all deals to be clean. You you do not deserve this awesome bassy soundtrack. You want all deals to be clean, so you need me to spend money on the bar. <sighs> That's how it works, right? I spend money, you give me the info. Maybe, maybe not. Okay then, give me a drink, but keep it under $80. Do we even have anything that cheap? Let's see what kind of drink you can get with that. Do everything is like $200. Yeah, everything is $200. Oh, gut punch. $80 exactly. He said under $80 though. There's nothing under $80. You're just gonna have to pay exactly $80. Uh, you're not getting any booze from me, so you just just the bare minimum. Just the bare necessi necessities. Age mixed. Here's your gut punch. Get out of my bar. Okay then. Okay then. Do you know anything about that girl? No. But you said. Maybe, maybe not. Turns out it's maybe not. You were the one deluding yourself into thinking I knew something. Like I said, eighty dollars is nothing. So I need to spend more? I'll give you some intel. Hold on, it's a little loud for me. There. Oop. Yeah, let's leave scan lines on, I guess. It fits the aesthetic. Spend all the money you want, but I know nothing and no amount will change that. Can I at least get my money back? Why? The order's right, isn't it? Uh, I guess. Look at look at this face. He's like that shall we do it guy. It's like mm, Yes. Oh baby. Oh yeah, that's the spot. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. <laughs> I did not mean to be voice acting Kermit orgasms today, but here we are. So, why are you looking for that girl, mister? Von Delay! Art Von Delay! Oh my god, Art Von Delay? Oh, I am Art the Von Delay. I, I, I talk like this now because I am the artist. I am the artist, yes. I am a private detective. It is what I do. So, I'll assume you're either looking for a missing girl or working for a creepy online stalker. You're assuming the girl I'm looking for is innocent, innocent or lost. She's not. She's half of the so-called Reapers. Oh, the Reapers again, Shepard. Of the city. Two guns for hire, the drag for whoever is resourceful enough to find wealthy and wealthy enough to pay them. Crimson Rose and Cobalt Lily, they call themselves. <laughs> Kermit Rose. They still sound more like teenagers' internet nicknames. So, who wanted you to track her? Let's get... Yeah. That's right. <coughs> I don't know. I got the letter with the instructions and a paycheck. What if it's a prank, bro? Online nickname prank. Gone sexual. I have the money, so what, I, so what do I care if it is? Besides, considering the amount I was able to cash in with that chick, it'd be a pretty wasteful prank. You, you gave me $80! You, you, that's like two dollars in real money. And you, 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 yeah. you're gonna brag about how much money you got? I'm gonna rub your bald spot for good luck. 
Well, it's more like a bald, like, planet, but whatever. I see. Still, any information or rules you could give me? They don't have to be related to the girl. Why do you need them? It's always good to keep up with local goings on. Well, let's see. Hmm. Sorry, can't think about anything right now. Most of the conversations you hear aren't rumor worthy. Humor worthy, maybe. Oh! But not much about current events, at least. Not beyond what you see on the news. Dumbass, what kind of bar is this if you don't cause a Zawad on this street? Oh. <laughs> this face. <laughs> what kind of film noir world do you think we live in? Gil might know something you're so fixated on finding some, some kind of information. I, I don't know what you're talking about. B Baka. It's not like I'm in a gang or anything. Baka. Do you know something that might help me, Gil? I don't. I certainly don't, and I'm offended by the suggestion that I do. I'm talking to my lawyers now. He knows something. On second thought, maybe it's better if you don't get involved with him. Oh, well, this has been a major waste of my time, this face. This is my old face, you see. Until I saw all the noise BTC bars have made lately, it would be useful for something. Noise? What noise? You don't know. I'm asking for a reason. You'll find out soon enough, don't worry. In any case, I guess I'll have another drink and leave. What can I get you? I'll have a Gleasley Temple. Simple enough. Alright, let's give him a Grizzly Temple. Uh, <laughs> this one's kind of unbearable. Ugh, the puns. Bronson extract. Cardabine, blood of news, all blended. You don't get a big one. Oh, some good, some good 80 is going on here. Here. Okay, then, this is going to be deducted from the $80 earlier, right? Have you literally ever made a money transaction with dollars? No, that's not how anything works. Fine. Come on, there has to be something. This week has been slow as hell. The only thing I found is about a girl who threw herself off the roof of a nearby mall. And the whole thing about the women catching her in mid-air makes me think it's totally made up. Aside from rumors that the Harbingers are looking for a- Oh, that's me. Aside from rumors that the Harbingers are looking to cause some troubles at a bank today. No, not really. Damn it. Wait, who told you that? Appeared on the news, didn't it? Yeah, but not the name The Harbingers wasn't used. No Glitch City outlet has reported that themselves. There are rumors that someone or something is keeping them silent. And even the international outlets aren't using the name Harbingers. They're avoiding acknowledging the organization yet, for some reason. See, so you're either one of them, or somebody easy know or told you about it. Wow, he can be surprisingly sharp. Yeah, Donovan D. Dawson was here for the last three days, actually. Should you really just say that? Really? I wonder if he'll notice the glass that Idol signed. And I mean, sure. I can't think of anything that would be useful in violating him now, but... Guess not. Did he talk about anything interesting? Interviewing the idol that had a show a couple days ago. Dealing with messy interns. Part for the course, I guess. I see, I see. That's... Gunshot! It's a backfire. Firecrackers! Hey, what do you think that sound just now was? Sounded like something's very heavy being dropped. What? No, it doesn't! Screw you! Get out of my bar! Something heavy? Come on, that's not even close. It was definitely more like an explosion of some kind. No, you could clearly hear the clashing of the metals. I am very artistic, so I know these things. Something that was both made out of metal and very heavy fell down. That's, that's what made the sound. How would you know that specifically? Whatever it is... Er, me. That's me again. It's not normal for it to be repeating so often. <coughs> I wonder if something's happening. I heard there was some scang spots going on. Maybe they talk the conflict here. 
which means gunshots. If that's the case, I just hope they don't come too near us. Well, I've got to go. Seems like something here wasn't the best of time after all. Really? Really. I just have different needs. But there will come a time when this place might help me. Goodbye. Please come again. Gangs then? Unlikely. This is unicorn territory. Unicorn territory! We in Ponyville now. But it's those damn earth ponies again. <laughs> Disgusting. <clears throat> They've always been a neutral an important third party in other gangs deals. The who what now? Why do you why are you such a why do you know all these gang things, Gillian? Are you are you not telling me something, fuckboy? Sigh, I'll just pretend I heard nothing. Thank you. You have me thinking about the whole noise from the BTC bars. What's up with that? I think I heard something about money laundering through bars. Don't take my word for it though. I see. Guess we'll find out soon enough. Welcome, Streaming Chan! I'm Streaming Chan! I'm giving you a- oh my god. What? Eight? It's like that thing stupid Nico video crap does with the, the comment scroll to the left over the screen. I don't- I don't know what 888 is though. I, I've seen WWWs. Did I miss bath time? What? Giving you a live feed of my life and adventures 24-7! Happy face. It's that meme face. Bathroom time and naughty time moments only available to premium users! Yeah, that's what you can get if you subscribe to my patron. Okay, no, maybe not. It's only $99.99 a month! Go premium now! Um... It's Friday night and you know what that means! It's time for streaming chance escapades! Ah! Wow. Today's escapade is brought to you by ShiningFinger.moe! It's, it's actually... Um, leaders of adult VR entertainment since 2069! Nice. Dot Moe is actually a real um, top level domain, by the way. We are in the darkest timeline already. Buy a year of premium membership and you'll get a code. Exchange the code for a free trial of VR experience after yours truly. Ugh. Get out of my bar. I hate everyone. Everyone in this game is terrible, except for Cat Year Lady. Dana's alright. Fuck boy. And myself. Everyone else just ugh. Today, pick the shoddiest, nastiest, smelliest, ugliest bar I could find downtown. Rude. And sadly, it actually kind of looks half decent inside. So much for going to a crap hole bar that smells like dog urine! Well, actually, if you came a few days ago, it was like dog piss city. <laughs> Gillian was like, <laughs> Excuse me. But no matter, tonight I'll give you the escapade you'll never forget! Hey you, where's the bartender? You're talking to her. Very funny. Where is he, really? Right in front of you. Hey you, the pretty boy over there. Where's the bartender? You're looking at him. N no way. No hot shirtless guy playing with fire and serving drinks while flirting with you? Anime was a mistake. It just said anime was a mistake. Yes, it's right there. I, I, I like that guy. That one guy, and the one that the one that wants 4chan to leave. <laughs> Those meme faces. There, there is an actual um, Super Mario Bros. ROM hack, like super hard ROM hack, based around that meme face, um, like with Mario as that face. <laughs> What's happening exactly? No sexy, scantily clad girl jiggling around the place. You telling me you two dress like fucking weird? Oh God, calm down. Um, you're telling me you two dress like fucking waiters of the bartenders here? I think that's pretty normal. Am, am I that loud when I make the, this voice? I guess I am. Well, I'll, I'll compress the audio later anyway. But I'm just, I'm watching the actual waveform as I talk. It's a really weird experience. But uh, I just had major peaking the last time I tried to record here, and I don't even know why. But I'm just being really cautious. You don't need to know this. Yep. Seems that way. Is that a problem? Of course it's a problem. If you're only listening to my voice, there's a bunch of crap scrolling across the screen on this, which is actually going to make the bitrate for this video insanely high. 
But uh, yeah, if you're only listening to my voice, you're missing some of this absolute garbage that is going on. Also, you can really tell this game is 30 frames per second now with the screen, the scrolling text. It's kind of ugh. Of course it's a problem. Friday nights are peak viewing hours. I need someone sexy or enticing to keep them interested. Oh well, there's an easy solution to that. Yeah, just take your top off. Aw, oh, you fucking... Get out of my bar. I, I should have known. You might need to tuck it up your bra too, depending on the how the traffic goes. Wait, you're quite flat. Do you even use a bra? W's. I hate you. You, you... I'm gonna throw you and that stupid loli bot in the frickin' garbage. You, you are not welcome here. Is that piercing glare a no? Yes. Come on, one of us is gonna have to take their top off and it ain't gonna be me. I already did, th did that once today. Ah, and it's too late to go somewhere else. By the time I find an even nastier bar, they'll be closed. What's your policy on wearing pants? <laughs> Somebody tried to have me fired for wearing a skirt, so we deal with that on a case-by-case -case basis. How do you? What? Never mind. That's not a concrete answer. I need a binary yes or no answer. My viewers have the attention span of fruit flies. If they wanted to use their brains, you think they'd watch something like this? Aww. I need to keep them entertained. The fact that you still have your shirt on isn't helping. Wait, I know. Give me a drink. A big one. The nastiest one you can think of. Ugh. You know what? No problem. I will give you the nastiest garbage we have, and we have a lot of garbage. Wow, it's like my brain shut down. You don't deserve this good music. You, 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 I hate you. Anime was a mistake, indeed. Alright. Manly and promo drinks are both nasty. Yeah, wasn't there a nasty, um... So unnecessarily brown. You know, there was something else. Promo drinks. The unbearable one, let's give her that. Wait, no, let's give her the most expensive one. No. The promo. Zen Star. Well, this sounds awful, so let's give it to her. Four of each ingredient mixed. On the rocks, mixed. Have your Zen Star. Wow, that is fancy. Here you go. All right then, cheers! I don't think you should chug it, chug it down so quickly. It's like it hit me, but I didn't feel it until a few seconds later. W's! Oh my god. Is this what being kicked in the balls feels like? Yep. <laughs> Thank you for your input, fuckboy. Alright, it's decided. Whoa. Whoa. Calm down. I'll get just get really wasted. It's gonna be fun enough, right? If you say so. Okay, in the meantime, what can you tell me about this bar? What do you mean? Weird stories, fun stuff, interesting facts. You're being seen by an average of 6,000 people. Make their time worth it. Hey kids, wanna die? I like that guy. That guy in the anime was a mistake guy. Those, those are the two, those are the two stream monsters that I do not hate. Everyone else, everyone else has to die. Ugh, Streaming Chan. If you're listening to just my voice, her name is literally Streaming Chan. Oops, I missed something. Last week we held a party for the Cypher Toy Company, and... It's a company run completely by dogs. Really? This place was completely overrun by corgis. Wait, 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 corgis? Ugh, don't make this face. W's! Did he really serve drinks to corgis? Tuxedo clad talking corgis, yeah. Wow, awesome! Wait, you're not shitting me, right? No, it was more like pissing. A lot of pissing. Just untold of amounts of pissing that even your children will hear about from the legends. Hello, fellow youngsters! 
How do you do, fellow kids? Um, oops, that was a bit loud. I wish I was shitting you, trust me, but instead I'm pissing you. What else, what else? Um, let's see. Donovan D. Dawson from the Augmented Eye here was three for three nights in a row. That perfume chauvinistic bastard W's. Huh, there's that word again. Just the other day, someone from the Augmented Eye interviewed me, actually. What'd they ask? Oh, the usual bullshit! Just who I was, future plans, inspirations. The one to interview with the small, weak girl with glasses. She seemed a bit bitter, though. I wonder why. It's, it's, all, it's all a closed loop in this game. But enough about that. Wait, can I see that glass over there? Hmm, sure. That signature. Is this Kira Mickey's autograph? Yeah, she came here through her last concert. Get out, really? Is this some kind of secret hidden bar of the stars or something? Not really. We're just in the right place at the right time. What kind of person is she when she's not on stage? I have a sneaking suspicion she might be a reaver bot. So that's fun. I tried to get a meeting with her and she actually seemed willing, but she's always busy. A nice girl, actually. She seems to be completely interested, invested in her work. She loves what she does and it shows. You'd think she'd be some sort of diva. As far as I'm concerned, she's one of the nicest people I've met. I knew it! I knew she was nice! Yes, Desu! Her passion shows in her concerts, you know? She's so spontaneous! Her performance is never the same. Every time she sings Shine Spark, <laughs> Shine Spark! <laughs> I feel like my soul is warming up like a high performance computer. I feel like I could run at high speeds and expose hidden areas. Shine Spark! Eights! What are the eights? I know what the W's are, but what are the eights? I find myself singing in the shower all the time. And those who pay premium can hear me sing every day at $9.99 a month. Go premium now! That aside, I was about to call bullshit on what you said. But I guess you do have some sort of proof for everything. Can I keep this glass? No. Pretty please? No. Party pooper. Aw, Desu. Resident Sleeper! They actually banned that emote today. I can see why. It's only used for trolling, basically. But I mean, so is everything on Twitch? I mean, you can't even have an emote of a guy, like a black guy, just an ordinary, actual human being, without it being used for racist purposes. So I mean, y you can't make a Twitch emote people can't use to offensive purposes. It's just impossible. Anyway. At least this bar might be more interesting than I initially thought. The one thing that make it perfect, this the pretty boy over there had a pass with the KGB. Who told <laughs> Gillian don't play your hand like that? Yeah, that'd be crazy, huh? Calm down, fuck boy. Are you gonna order anything else? What? Oh yeah, the whole getting wasted thing. Oops. I heard of a drink called a bad touch. Get me one of those, please. A big bad touch. <laughs> Coming right up. <laughs> Let's <laughs> give her a... <clears throat> a big bad touch. By the big bad wolf. Bronson up. Soiled it. One, two. Uh, eight of these. Um, on the rocks. Mixed. Have your big bad touch. I was expecting something dirtier. We have olive brine. I can pour in a bit if that's what you want. <laughs> Delicious. No, not that. With such a dirty name, it feels like the drink ought to come with a phallic glass. It'd be like this thick white liquid. Ugh. That would have skyrocketed the watchers at least threefold. Don't you have anything like that? Nope. Sigh. I guess I'll have to make do with the condensed milk when I get home. Uh, get out of my bar. Friendly reminder that today's escapade is brought to you by ShiningFinger.moe. Leaders of VR adult entertainment since 2069. Buy a year premium membership for Nico Desu. 
Said code will give you a free trial of VR experience with a model based on moi. Ugh. I hate you. What's the deal with that VR experience? Well, a fan made an ND model of me. That's totally not creepy. When Shining Fingered asked me about a model model for our partnership, I just contacted him. He got money for polishing the model a lot more, and I got my partnership. We all won. I got him a year of free premium membership and a VR set. That's nice. Wait, what's NND? Don't tell me you haven't heard of Niku Niku Dance. Oh my god. Ugh. It's... That's a program they use to make the Vocaloid programs, I guess. Miku Miku Dance. I asked for a reason. It's, well, it's a m music video for 3D models. Yeah, that sounds like a good enough explanation. Moon. I see. To be honest, though, the model is a bit meatier than me. Oh, thick. Not that I mind, though. Ugh. I hate you. Not that I mind though, considering the use it gets. Uh -huh. You know, I was expecting you to be more scared when I said that you're being watched by a lot of people. It's hard to be scared when you can't see these people. But they're still here, you know? Desu, yes, streaming fan. <laughs> Kids want to die. <sighs> sure, they're behind screen. Sure, they're behind screens and sometimes the opposite corner of the world, but every single one of my viewers is a real person with a real life. These people do not have lives, I'm sorry. Not being here doesn't make them any less real. Marry me, streaming chat, I'm a I understand, but it's just not the same. They're not here visibly paying attention to me. I don't get paranoid just because of my phone contacts. That's true, I guess. So tell me, what made a lady like you become a bartender? It's not exactly an exciting story. Does it involve a man? No. What about a crime? No. A childhood promise? No. A religious vow? No. A what? You're not going to tell me that you just decided out of the blue to quit your job and start bartending? That's actually what happened, sort of. Oh, come on, no epiphany, quarter life crisis. If there isn't a half life one mod called quarter life crisis, I will be extremely disappointed. Half life, quarter life crisis. That sounds like the prequel to full life consequences. I want to see this now. I need to see this amazing machinima masterpiece that is half life, quarter life crisis. Not even a hot teacher somewhere along the line. <coughs> Life isn't always a young adult novel where every decision has a road cone. What? 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 Shut up, Jill. And that's the problem. One third of my audience are teens that shouldn't be allowed to watch my streams. Throw me a freaking bone here. There must be a nice mystical story you can tell me about yourself, Miss Bartender. Well... Yes? Mm, yes? Sometime after I started working, I got an interesting client. Who is a dark soul, a really old Lilla model. This is so edgy. Apparently his power supply is running low. Oh my god, the edge. It just gets edgier. His charger was destroyed, and he didn't have the money to buy upgrades or replacements. He always seemed to have neglected his maintenance. Oh my god, I just cut myself on this edge. He was... He was from the time the collective source wasn't a cloud storage system. So he wouldn't be uploaded there once his body ran out of energy. Keep going! It was weird, you know? He was the only little limb I ever met with a clear-cut fear of mortality. No transcendence for him. He would disappear when his batteries ran out. It's like knowing you'll vanish when someone else, everyone else passes on to heaven, he said. Oh man! I guess he felt bad burdening everyone else with his problems. So he went and gave me a fingertip of his that fell while we were talking. That's not gross and nasty at all. Before he left, he said, If you remember me, maybe a part of me will transcend. Dot, dot, dot. Um. Bravo! Bravo! Touching, full of feeling, completely awesome! I'd love to pay, his, I'd pay to see a movie like that. So what happened to that finger? 
I made a pendant out of it. I carry it with me at all times. Even while bathing! Almost all times? Now that I think about it, how do you handle the stream if you want to watch a movie or something? I have a plugin that lays mosaic censorship over what I watch on TV or in the theater. I see. Stop. Stop this. Okay, this is getting stale. I'm gonna heat this up if I have to do it myself. We need to drop a cow in here. What? Miss Bartender, get me drunk. I don't care how, just do it. Okay. Need to get her drunk no matter what. That's an interesting request. I wonder what would happen if I gave her a non-alcoholic drink here. I wanna continue on the right path though. So let's give her, what's that thing that's basically every ever clear? Frothy water? No. There we go. Fringe Weaver. Aged, mixed. Have your have your female reproductive system drink. So? Oh my god. Don't do that. Lightheadedness. Clumsy tongue. Palm sweaty, knees weak, arms spaghetti. <laughs> <laughs> Mom's spaghetti. Can't feel my legs. Can't feel my legs. <laughs> All right, let's get on with the lewd stuff. Uh, first, I'll try to guess your bust size. Is that really that exciting? I mean, worst case, you could be off by one, maybe two cup sizes if you're like not very good. I mean, it's really not very interesting. I must warn you, I have a 90% success rate with this! I mean, if we're just going by cup size, I guess. If we're going by measurements, that'd be significantly harder. B, not big enough to fill a hand, but not small enough to make you look like a child. You're a size B, right? I'm not discussing my bust. Don't be like that, I can tell you're a B cup. Your attitude makes me think you're an S, and your behavior makes me think your blood type is AB. What? Oh, like sadist, maybe? What? Uh, I hate you. So, how many did I get right? Who knows? Resident sleeper. Drop a cow! Ah, uh, please let me get on with this. I need to cooperate if this is going to be a success. Can I ask something? Finally! What's the point of getting drunk if you're going to behave the same way? <laughs> I guess it is kind of redundant. Because, you see, I'm drunk 24-7. What? You, you, liver, cirrhosis, you, you will die. You, you're, you're gonna die. You know what? I don't care. Die. You and LoliBot9000 can just go die somewhere that is not on the premises so I don't get in trouble and just peacefully die and I will be happy. Knowing people want to watch me do anything and everything, seeing the viewer count steadily rise as I take more risks and become more adventurous, it's a feeling that neither alcohol nor sex can compare to. Speaking of sex, if I get lucky tonight, you only need to pay $99.99 to see what happens afterwards. Go premium or go home. Um, do you really get lucky if the other person knows they're being streamed? You'd be surprised by how many are actually turned on by that. How do you deal with people who don't want their identities revealed? Everything's written here. By being captured by this camera, you hereby consent to the use of your face on all material provided by Streaming Chan LLC. That's not how laws work. I'm not sure how legal that is. People believe it is, and I've yet to be troubled by a lawyer. You know, that's actually something that, in terms of service, they're not actually guaranteed to be legal. So they can write basically literally anything and they just have to wait to be challenged in a court. So uh, terms of services are basically hot garbage. People believe it and I'm, yet, and I'm yet to be troubled by a lawyer. It's funny though, when you're on the street, unless it's somebody really hot, you can't recall their faces, but learn their name and suddenly they're a fucking snowflake that's better than all the rest. Huh, this is weird. I'm feeling sleepy. Fuck you! All these tables being thrown. You did ask me to get drunk. Why is that weird? 
because I haven't felt sleepy in quite some time. In fact, I've been sleep deprived for a while now. You're you're gonna die. You know that? A week. You're you're gonna die. Please die outside of my bar. A week? Weeks are the ones with 30 days, right? Would someone please get this walking corpse out of my bar? Um. Yep, totally sleepy. I can feel my eyes getting heavier. There's this weird lag when I try to move. What's up with that? Please die somewhere where I'm not considered responsible for it. Anyway, I think I'll take a little nap here. Not in the bar. Get Go outside, please. Before storming off and continuing the night. If you'll excuse me, don't. <sighs> she did it. Should I call a cab? Risk waking her up? Leave her be. I'd rather break the rules and let her sleep than deal with her again. I'm gonna take my break now. It's been a while since I've needed a cigarette this badly. Alright. That, that, that is not a B cup. That's me, right? I think that's me. Look at them booty shorts. Yeah, that, that is not a B cup. I mean, at least not. I actually know Japanese cup sizes better than I know American ones, because that's one of the stats they always list. Like, they don't list, like, their heights and weights to complete bullcrap. But in Japanese, like, character descriptions, you can always depend on the blood type. Very important, totally not superstitious bullshit. And the cup size, that's... You gotta have those, obviously. Those are the important things, not like, you know, height or weight. Like, Goku is like... Goku is like 100, like 10 pounds or something. Goku is lighter than I am. You know, he's... He's got hollow bones, apparently. Anyway... That is enough Valhalla for tonight. I need to get out of this chair. Join us next time for uh, stuff. Hopefully people that are less garbage than LowlyBot9000 and whatever just happened there. Whew.